previously on ASMR in the South. Don't touch my reefer. I know it's hard to believe with my room smelling like reefer, but it was mine. Ah! That just got me mad all over again. I'm telling the truth. You have to believe me. <laughs> I'm gonna have to tell your mother. That hurt more than my last relationship. I wonder how hard she'd hit me if she found I took $10 from her purse. I don't understand. I don't understand why I keep getting hit. You cannot be stealing. No stealing. You... Oh, 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 stop. Oh, I didn't steal it. Oh, oh. Man, that's crazy. I'm a grown man and I just got whooped by my auntie. I can't tell nobody about this. But more importantly, who could have taken Auntie's reefer? There's only one other person in the house. Wait. What's up, y'all? Before we get into this next episode, I just want to thank each and every one of y'all who dropped a like and a farmer emoji on the last episode. Like, the support on that last episode was crazy. That's why this next one's going to be a banger. Yo, Emilio. You're up. Yeah, I couldn't go to sleep. <laughs> what are you doing up? I was just making a TikTok. <laughs> a TikTok. That's a bet. This man is really gonna ignore the fact that he just sold me his mom's reefer. You know how it is. Yeah, I. I kind of do know what it's like. I, I know that sometimes you actually like to meet up with strangers at night and make deals. Don't act surprised now. <laughs> Just be honest with me, bro. Did you sell me your mom's reefer? Yeah. <laughs> You're a joke. <laughs> you shouldn't be making TikToks and meeting up with strangers every day. You should be looking for a nine to five. Isn't that what boomers do? No, that's what normal and real people do. <laughs> You want to hear something dumb? You think you can make a living off a Chinese communist app? We'll see how long that lasts. And I'm going to tell you this. You need to stop selling reefer. People who do that, they go to jail. I'm sure that'll never happen to me, though. You think that now? <laughs> Keep moving the way you're moving? You'll end up just like them. Look, I know it sounds like I, I hate you, but I don't. I'm, I'm just trying to look out for you, man. I, I don't want to see you locked up. But yeah, that's that's all I want to say. I'm going I'm to get some sleep. I'll see you tomorrow. Good night. Good night. Yup, it's saying the same thing. It's... It's not working, your car's declined. How dare you tell me my gift card is not valid? Hey, I'm sorry. I'd like to say that it's an error with our system, but your car's the only one that hasn't worked all day. Run it again. Ma'am, we scanned your car 13 times already. There's no money on it. <laughs> Ma'am, oh. please calm down. You're making a scene. I'll, I'll scan it one more time. Just calm down. Let me see your card. Here. Are you serious, ma'am? Take this back. That's not a Starbucks card. That's for Academy. Oh. Here. <clears throat> this is my Starbucks gift card. Now run that for me. Okay, Starbucks. Let's try it. I'm sure it'll work. She didn't. It got declined. No, no. No. I'm about to fight somebody up in here if my gift card is not working. Uh, ma'am, this is Starbucks. This isn't karate class. If you want to get physical, I'm going to have to call the police. No, 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 no. You do not have to call the police. Obviously, I do not mean physically fight. It looked like you was ready. Okay, listen. Why do you think I have a husband of 11 years? What is your 
husband have to do with this? And plus, <laughs> he probably cheats on you. Loving husband of 11 years, might I add, because of this face. Cap. <laughs> Karen, the only way that statement's true is if your husband's blind. <laughs> Ma'am, please keep it down. And I thought we just went over this. He, he's still on vacation. Manager, now. Ma'am, look. I honestly don't think my manager is going to help your cause. And I'm saying this as a friend. But for you, I'll give him a call. Your call has been forwarded yeah. to an automatic. Yeah, just as I expected. It's, it went straight to voicemail. Oh shoot, I just got a notification. He's streaming actually. Let me see if I can get his attention that way. Yo Maddie, answer your phone. Karen is I'm just gonna get him to respond. Oh, Karen is about to blow up the office. Let's see if he responds. Um absolutely insane. Um yo, real deal, Khalil, my guy, what's good? Hope you're doing well, man. That's it? Answer your phone. I mean, you, you saw it. You saw him. That's my manager. That's the best I can do. Wow. I warned you. He is a busy man. Man, even though Karen be acting like a B-I-T-C-H, I actually feel bad for her. It's 102 degrees in the south right now, and all she wants is the water. Hey, Karen, uh, I know we bicker a lot, but... I'm not gonna lie, you've been growing on to me, so I'm gonna hook you up with the free water. Oh, perfect. Someone from the drive-thru actually wasn't able to afford the water, so here's one for free. I would have had to throw it out anyways. Yes, yes, yes. Don't tell my boss about this. I might lose my job. He hates giving out free stuff. The price of that water is more than I get paid in a day. Oh, no, 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 no. Are you seriously complaining, Karen? What's wrong with the drink? It, it's a free drink. It, it's not that bad. It's just water. <laughs> what was that for? It's terrible. How? It's just water. Make it again. Are you crazy? Hell no. I gave you a free drink and you want to splash it in my face? Nah, you better leave or I'm going to call the police. <sighs> yeah, right. All right. Stay right there. Yeah, I'd like to report a Karen who has assaulted me with an unknown liquid device. This woman, now dubbed the downtown Karen, accused of hurling racial slurs, harassing people. No, it's, it's a big misunderstanding. I was the one brutally harassed, as the camera will show. It, no, she wasn't. She harassed me. You'll be hearing from my lawyer. Yeah, right. She couldn't even afford a water. How's she gonna afford a lawyer? Man, I swear, Karen's just be talking about nothing. Man, got me hungry. What's in this fridge? Uh, what, did, what is this, a line? What am I gonna do with that? Uh, what's in this drawer? What is this, a tomato, a bell pepper? Did someone eat that already? Emilio! <laughs> Is there just ingredients in here? Man, I gotta go order some fast food now. Should I drive or, here, let me check DoorDash real quick. Um, uh, I guess I'll eat Wendy's, why not? Ooh, okay, now they're trying to scam me. Tip before, y'all forgot my drink last time. But you know what, I'm not gonna hold a grudge. I'll, I'll tip before this time. Oh man, that was quick. Your food is ready and has been picked up by your driver. Wait, hold on, I recognize him. Is that, is that the dude from the bus stop? Ain't no way, he might, he might eat my food. That's definitely him. This is crazy. What were the odds of this happening? <laughs> man, I swear, he better not eat my food. Nah, he wouldn't. He, he could lose his job over this. He's, he's not that dumb, is he? Come to the back. Front door don't work. 
So what'd you order again? I had the wings. Oh, I don't know what they did, bro. They just gave me like a bunch of condiments. What do you mean? Bro, they didn't have the sandwich. They didn't have the fries. They didn't have uh, baked potatoes bro. either. Are you serious? And they gave me some napkins. I don't need napkins. What happened to the rest of the food I ordered? The app said the food was ready. I left you a five dollar tip. I don't know, man. Bro, I know you ate my oh, food. Oh, oh, oh. I, I gave you a tip. Let go. I don't give a fuck about your little food, nigga. Don't ever don't put your hands on me, Let nigga. Go of me. Just because you see I do do all that shit, nigga. appreciate each and every one of y'all who made it to the end if you enjoyed and want to see episode eight spam the farmer emoji 